Welcome everybody to another video. We are here with the first of two semifinal matches, Gates of Olympus versus Sweet Bonanza. And then the next video, of course, will be Monster Super Lanter versus Sugar Rush. The winner of each one moves on to the finals for the right to be crowned the number one machine of the stake bracket 2023. Uh, Gates of Olympus had to go through Doghouse Megaways and Gems Bonanza while Sweet Bonanza has taken out. Uh, uh, Big Bass, Amazon, and Chicken Drop in order to get here. So Gates of Olympus and Sweet Bonanza coming up right here. Two definite favorites, two powerhouse machines. Let's go ahead and start off here. We get 16,000 coins down in the balance. We're doing four 4,000 coin buys. Whichever machine ends up with most coins at the end of its four 4,000 coins moves on to the final round. Pretty simple. Let's go ahead and get started here. This is the first of four buys here. Four Gates of Olympus. We get 3x already on the board. I'm, uh, I'm excited for this one. It was uh, a little bit of a rocky start for Gates, but it, uh, it finally managed to work its way around to getting into the semifinals here. So we'll see if we can get Zeus to take advantage of his position. Instead of doing just enough to move on, maybe we can, you know, absolutely, absolutely just knock it out of the park. I wasn't going to. Again, say anything. I was looking for a multiplier there. That was a top symbol hit for 400 coins, but uh, this 3x on the board is not looking as great as it was when it happened in the first couple of spins. We are getting connections and we are getting tumbles. We're just not getting multipliers out of the old man here. Maybe he's holding out for us for the second bonus buy. That must be it. He knows what's on the line here. He knows these aren't you know, very big hits through the rest of the game here. So uh, yeah, that's going to be it. He's just, he's holding out on us. He knows what's coming. He's just trying to make it dramatic. Zeus is a real, uh, a real card like that. All right. 1,038 coins coming back from 4,000. Definitely not what we were looking for there. Let's go ahead and get on to our second bonus buy. You noticed a little bit of a jump right there. Uh, I did have to pause real quick. Just wanted to double check and make sure that my microphone was actually recording. Um, you know, we've already had that problem once during this, so I forgot to double check. Just wanted to make absolutely sure here. So we are on our second 4,000 coin buy. Today is not the day to be stingy with your multiplier, Zeus. This is not for me. This is for you. 2x on the board get a double zap there make it a 6x nine spins left to go 6x on the board again Zeus these are not about me these are all about you you showing off you showing what you can do I'm not here for my own personal glory we are here for you you however don't seem to care and you are not showing off at all for the viewers so uh, I'm, I'm just gonna I can't blame anybody but you. Now would be a good time to step in with a big zap. 2x isn't exactly big, but it's bigger than the one that wasn't there. And already we're having a much better uh, bonus round than we did in the first one. Eighteen eighty-two from 4,000. Almost half back from what we started with. Uh... As far as I'm concerned, Zeus is over two. Now we all know Sweet Bonanza. Sweet Bonanza can absolutely knock it out of the park, or it can do um, nothing at all. And it's very, very good at doing both of them. Unfortunately, so is Gates of Olympus. So fingers crossed that each one of them does something worth watching. However, we're ten spins left here, and six uh, X finally on the board, which is nice to see it do something here. Oh man, I hope you guys are all having a good day because Zeus certainly isn't so far. Um, I, however, am having a fantastic day. I am. I. Sorry about that. A yawn snuck in, a, snuck up on me there. Uh, I, I finished my work day. I am, I'm home for the night, so I wanted to make sure that I get the recording done for y'all so that we continue on with our daily uploads here and i do upload every single day here on the channel if you aren't familiar if you do like this sort of thing take a second go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below so you don't miss any of the future uploads 
19x on the board is a good number to have, but only two spins left to go is a bad time to get to it. It does seem that Zeus is finally waking up, however. Maybe a long way to go, but maybe blue? Blue and rings, how about another zap? No, no extra multipliers, but 22x is okay. 5808, finally we get a decent win here. We get 8300. Last spin is a dead spin, but 8384 on our third buy. Finally showing signs of life. I thought we were going to get all four of them to line up there, but was not the case. All right, Zeus, this is your fourth and final chance. Now's the time to break out the max win. 4X does not look like a max win. All right, I'm at 10X on the board this early. Certainly looks nice to me. We have, have seen things like this before, though, so we're... Once again, we're not going to get super excited about it until there's something to get excited about. Also, now realizing we haven't had a retrigger yet, which is kind of surprising. It's not exactly an uncommon thing over here on Gates. But we do at least have, to have a double digit multiplier with double digit spins left, which is the ideal spot to be in. Well, that's most of the board gone. You better have dropped a second multiplier in there for that one. That was a nice big hit. 5946 means that we are once again in a profit buy. This time with eight spins left to go with a 16x on the board. One more yellow? No more yellows. Never mind. Hoping to sneak one more in there. Now we are getting close to the end of our tournament here. So regardless of who wins, take a minute. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what games you want to see in the uh, upcoming time afterwards. So we can go ahead and play some games that you guys want to see. 29X, again, sitting on the board here. Only two spins left to go. And the final spin. Final spin is a dead spin, but 7,042. So we get 18,346. Let me go ahead and write that down real quick, and I will be back with Sweet Bonanza. All right, here we are with Sweet Bonanza, a fresh 16,000 coins in the balance. We're going to go ahead and start off, get things rolling. We're looking to beat 18,346 coins put up by Gems Bonanza. Sweet Bonanza has to do a little bit of work to be able to move on to the finals, as it turns out. However, one really good tumble and a real sneaky 50 or 100x multiplier get the job done real fast uh, i know we hit a 50x at some point during these uh tournaments here and that definitely helped move on to the 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 subsequent round maybe we can get it to do it again today it doesn't look like it's going to be on this bonus buy this is a uh a terrible way to start out it was 140 coins Coming back on a 4,000 coin buy there. Gonna get a fresh 10 spins on the board. We're gonna just forget that ever happened, Sweet Bonanza. Go ahead and move on. And uh, go ahead and do your thing here and make sure that you don't just absolutely fall apart and do nothing in the semifinals. I know you haven't used up all of your 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 winning winning spins yet. A pretty good looking tumble screen there. Watermelons maybe? No watermelons coming in, but a nice tumble. Very nice multiplier for 2546. Gonna need a few more of those, but I know you're capable of it. You just did it. We all saw. All right, final spin. Now we got one good spin on that one. He gave us a 2906. Of course, this is also how Gates started out just a second ago. We had a couple of bad buys, and then all of a sudden, boom, we had uh, two wins in a row, so. All it takes is one good bonus buy, and we've seen in the past. Um, we saw the matchup earlier between uh, Sugar Rush and Wild West Gold Megaways that I thought it was going to be an upset, but Sugar Rush absolutely turned it turned it on at the end there and uh, came through with a win. So uh, it, it's been it's been an unpredictable tournament. There's no way to be able to look at any of the turn any of the matchups and just say for sure that's the one that's going to win or this is the one that's going to move on it's been 
uh, really back and forth with some surprises. So uh, I don't know if it's been as enjoyable for you all watching as it has been for me to play it. Uh, but I've certainly been having a good time working my way through it. 39.68 so far. We're so close to a profit buy. There we go. Multiplier. Big one, please. No, no big multiplier, but a 15x is okay. Another thousand coins does put us into our first profit buyer for Sweet Bonanza. Still have three spins left to go here. Uh, that 8x dropping in is going to help out uh, more than you probably think. Another 1150 puts us at 6,000. Starting to work exactly like uh, Gates of Olympus did. Except we're going to need a bigger win on the third game instead of on the second one. But there is still hope here. We are at 6,278, puts us at 13,324. Again, we're looking to beat 18,346. So after we buy this, we're gonna need about 9,000 coins. A little over 9,000 coins on this win. So um, it's not impossible. It can certainly be done. Let's go ahead and see you go ahead and get that done, Sweet Bonanza. We need about a thousand coin win on every single spin on average or just one really, really good win. Uh, extra spins would also be cool. We have, oh, there, there's a, as I was saying it, there is a four scatter bonus there. Only still only gives you five spins back, but it does give you extra on the win. There's another retrigger for another five spins. No, that please multiplier. All right, that's a 20 X multiplier. That's an 11,160 coin win. And uh, that's going to put it over 20,000 total if you can do the math. Sweet Bonanza with one good spin. Moving on, taking out Gates of Olympus. 14 spins still left. So we're going to go in from some overkill here. And like I was saying, all it takes is one good spin, one good bonus to be able to pull it off. And looks like Sweet Bonanza is going to go ahead and rub it in a little bit here in the fourth and final buy. All right, that's the end of the original 10 spins. We still have the 10 spins we got for our retriggers left, however. So 13,298 would have been the base bonus. Now we've got extra spins here. Sweet Bonanza is really good at doing very little with all of its extra spins when it gets them. So let's see if it can continue that tradition. We are at least getting connections, which is unusual for the, uh, the extra spin retriggers here. There is one set of five spins down. Here's the extra five. Doesn't look like it's doing a whole heck of a lot, but it doesn't need to. Sweet Bonanza's already secured a spot in the finals. Now it's just a matter of seeing, oh, never mind. We get five more spins coming up here, but it's just a matter of seeing now which of the other two finalists is Sweet Bonanza going to go ahead and face off against, against in our finals on, I want to say, Saturday? Maybe Sunday. Um, I don't have it in front of me. I'm just sort of trying to do it in my head as I'm thinking about it. This weekend, this coming weekend, if you're watching this as they're being uploaded in real time, it would be this coming weekend. If you're watching this sometime afterwards, it was uh, quite some time ago, so never mind. But 14,610 puts us at 23,934. So despite Gates of Olympus coming back and giving us an overall profit, uh, we got a much bigger win here on Sweet Bonanza, taking them out, 23,934. Who will they face? Leave it in the comments down below. Who do you think is going to be the winner of the next round, and who's going to win the overall? Is it going to be Sweet Bonanza moving on to the finals and taking it all? Will Sugar Rush continue its comeback in big wins? in order to move on to the finals and then face off against Sweet Bonanza in what would be a a very great tooth decay giving a showdown. I don't know, but we're sure going to find out. Thank you all for joining me, and I'll see you in the next one.